then how do you identify that the women is going into collapse so you uh, this chart you can get in your question also they can give you a scenario and they can ask you the patient's temperature is this blood pressure is this pulse is this and they will give you the chart you don't have to memorize it and they will, you will have to calculate a mu score so mu uh, it is modified early obstetric warning score so based on the score you get they ask you what will you do next so this is how the questions have been asked both in part 2 and part 3 so this is important so uh, if you get the score based on your clinical scenario the score is between 1 and 3 what will you do here in this case you will just inform the registered midwife because the score is low you just inform the registered ward registered midwife and uh, he she will review the patient again and if uh, any immediate concern is there then medical review should be done and if there are no uh, no clinical concern, concerns then she uh, then a repeat assessment should be done between 30, uh, within 30 to 60 minutes and even after 30 to 60 minutes if the score remains the same so then you uh, request the tier 1 doctor or sho which is the lowest uh, level doctor to visit and review the patient within 30 minutes so this you should remember if the score is low between 1 to 3 only registered midwife will review and then she will uh, see if there is any concern or if the score remains the same within 30 to 60 minutes then she will ask the tier 1 doctor or sho to come and review the patient understood is yes, ma'am if the score is more than equal to 3 or 3 in any parameter any of these is there then you have to think of sepsis in that case first the ward registered midwife or ward coordinator should be informed and the, the ward coordinator must review the patient and she should ask immediately she should ask in this case she will wait for 30 to 60 minutes or if there are there is deteriorating or uh, score or clinical concerns are that then only she was informing the tier 1 doctor so here she will uh, if the score is more than equal to 4 or 3 she will immediately inform the tier 1 doctor or sho to review the patient within 30 minutes if tier 1 doctor or sho is unable to attend then obstetric registrar st3 to st5 or senior registrar st6 to st7 should come and review and one early observation should be made you should do a urine analysis and commence fetal monitoring if it is an antenatal patient then if the mu score is more than equal to 6 then what you have to do then the re- registered midwife they have to contact the senior people they have to contact here tier 1 doctor is not informed directly obstetric registrar that is st3 to st5 or senior registrar and anesthetic registrar they have to uh, they have to come and review the patient on urgent basis so here th- uh, and they have to attend within 30 minutes so you they you will send an urgent review for these all the three uh, doctors obstetric registrar senior registrar and anesthetic registrar if the doctors are unable to attend if any, or any of these are unable to attend then consultant obstetrician on call and fourth on call anesthetist should come and attend the patient doctors to review and record management plan in the notes and in case uh, they if they recognize it as an emergency they have to co- uh, contact recognize and respond team the number is 4 times 4 if uh, this was about mu score more than equal to 6 if however the patient is deteriorating further or fails to respond to the treatment that has been given then you have to seek an exp- ex- uh, expert help then urgently you have to call the consultant obstetric consultant and anesthetic consult uh, obstetric anesthetist and if there is an emergency then you have to call uh, four times two and uh, state the emergency and ask the obstetric emergency team also to come and if the fetus is also compromised then you have to also contact neonatal emergency team okay so this is the next thing is just the same if the help is needed urgently if the patient's condition continues to deteriorate then you have to call emergency uh, which is four times two cardiac arrest call if critical care medical team review uh required then you have to call this number 0012 so these are the numbers you, you should remember and this kind of questions can be asked in your score uh, uh in your exam so you should know uh, you don't have to remember this chart but you have to remember that if the score is this what to do if the score is this what to do so this much you should remember